Hello, um, this is a recording I'm making to show you how to put a reflection on the bottom of a picture. Here I've got the cathedral in a nice autumnal setting and uh, first I want to check the image size. So go to image, resize, image size and I can see that it reads 1580 by 1189 which is just fine. Click OK. Now what I need to do is put added canvas at the bottom so I do image resize, canvas size, change the centimeters to percentage, change 100 to 200 for the height, uh, make sure relative is not ticked, click this up arrow here, make sure background is white but it doesn't matter, click OK and as you can see from the layers palette it's fine, if I double click the hand you can see it all, duplicate this with that sort of thing, uh, click onto the new layer icon then we need to flip this down vertically. Uh, you can click rotate, click, and you could just rotate it uh, 180 degrees, couldn't you? But that unfortunately puts the spire on the wrong side. So let's undo that. And go to image, rotate, and then go down to flip layer vertically. And that's what we want. Right. Then we go to the filters to filter it, distort and we could go to ocean ripples which I've just suggested in my text I've really gone off that idea it's okay but it's not brilliant so but I found that glass right next to it is superb look at that and that's as I've said it with blocks as it normally comes out as frosted like that which obviously is no good but blocks seems to be fine and invert seems to be better, better too because it gets rid of these streaks okay so click OK and then we need to bring the, the bottom layer through and we can do that with a blending mode, namely darken. And there it is, perfect. Now the bot the uh, what we need to do is move this this layer, then top layer, upwards slightly to get rid of these marks. So if we click on the move tool, just click once on the image, then use the arrow vertical up arrow keys, I mean three or four times, and that's that. Then we can flatten it and crop it, crop that white bit off with the crop tool. So we've got the crop tool here, crop, across like that. And a bit to the left. Not too much. That's it. Okay, and then save it, and there you have a reflection. Thank you.